Hey guys, Chance here with Complete Trailers. Today we're going to take a look at a trailer that's built on the platform of one of our uh, workhorses, as we would call it, one of the highest quality uh, aluminum cargo trailers on the market. Uh, before we start the video though, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get notified by YouTube when our new videos come up. Also check us out on social media, Facebook, Instagram, all that. We're always posting cool stuff. Like I mentioned in the intro there, uh, this trailer is built on one of our most popular platforms. That would be the uh, DVN as we call it, or Deluxe Venos, also known as Superstructure Cargo uh, for many reasons. Obviously it's got a premium deluxe look and a deluxe quality. Uh, when we talk about the superstructure aspect of that, that's the way the all tubular aluminum frame is put together. You've got a ton more weld contact in each of those cross members that actually attaches to that main frame, you know, compared to your standard trailer, hence the name Superstructure. Size of this trailer is seven by 17. And what that means is 14 foot box plus a three foot Venos. It might be the most popular size we do in this particular trailer. You can see there are these doors on the outside and what those are, are expandable tents with a full size mattress inside. So you've got a, a sleeping quarter and actually we have one on each side of the trailer. We'll see that on the other side. You've also got a 12 foot manual awning here um, so that you can put that out, have your lawn chair, your camp set up, all of that, you know, it really is pretty amazing package. You've got all kinds of electrical power, cabinetry, you name it. It's really ready to go. As well as just a great aesthetic that Legend Trailers and Complete Trailers is known for. One of the best things about this trailer, which we've no doubt mentioned before, is it's all aluminum construction. You get a significant weight savings, you know, versus a similarly built steel trailer, not to mention things like road salts and all that. They don't erode it the same way, so you don't have rust issues going down the road. Which means you get a trailer that's one, built better, and two, will last you much longer. One of the small details, but great features of this trailer is this little locking hasp here. You can see it operates easily enough and it's keyed to your trailer specifically. So you don't have to worry about padlocks and things like that that are easy to cut off. All you have to do is have your key and you can lock and unlock your trailer with ease. And you can see this is a really strong, sturdy latch system, you know, that uh, allows you to quickly open up your door. Now this particular trailer and really every deluxe Vino's that we do, we do with an 84 inch seven foot interior height. The reason we do that is so you can fit your Ranger, your Razor, your k and whatever it is, those things are quite a bit taller than, uh, you know, than your standard little UTV. So you need that extra height to be able to fit in. On the inside of the trailer here, first thing I notice is when these pop-out sleepers are completely enclosed in their, in their stored position, they don't really inhibit with the floor space at all. If you look at your entry point from the outside, you realize your, your vehicle fits in here and these aren't in the way whatsoever. You know, there's some nice features on the inside of this trailer. You see the roof in there, that's actually braced and wired for air conditioning. So if you choose to, you can run your trailer down to some RV place and they can drop an air conditioning in there. They can do it in less than an hour. So it's prepared to receive an air conditioning. Uh, and there's a lot of times we just add those, but in this particular one, we did not. This flooring, it looks a lot like plywood. It is not plywood. I'm sure you've heard us talk many, many times about Advantech and Drymax, you know, different names for the same thing. Uh, this is a great flooring, completely waterproof. In fact, we put it in our snowmobile trailers up north because you can just tilt the trailer up and let the slush essentially run out. We do have other flooring options for this. In fact, we will do a Line X, you know, just like the bed of your truck, a bed liner material on this floor, which we normally have one of those in stock as well as another option. Of course, it's a little more expensive, but it is very rugged and it's very popular as well. You've got windows for natural light, of course, a screen door here. And you've got these large, large lights as well as some, some smaller lights on the side. These are 12 volt, these are 110 up here. D-rings, of course, for tying down. You've got a 30 amp breaker box and off of that breaker box runs your receptacles. And you've got two duplex outlets here that you can plug various items in and have 30 amps of reserve power to run those off of when you're plugged in. And, and you notice on the outside, a little box, that's for your shore power cord to plug into if you're at a campsite or what have you, or there's an adapter, 30 amp adapter you can get that plugs into maybe your generator you have. Like I had said earlier, guys, it's really quick to fully deploy this, we'll call it a campsite. Look at my watch, this should take me no more than five minutes, so I'm gonna do that for you here. There you have it, folks. 
fully deployed in less than five minutes. Thanks for checking out the video today. Remember, like, share, subscribe, like I said earlier. Hit the notification bell. Uh, give us an opportunity to earn your business, guys. We've got nationwide shipping available. If you're not in one of our many markets that we uh, are set up in, we can get a trailer to you. Have a great day.